Can greasing the groove build muscle? This is one of those questions that pops up pretty consistently in the comment section. And for those who don't know, greasing the groove is a method of using a high volume of low to moderate effort sets spread throughout the day with plenty of rest between the sets. And depending on your level of fitness, it can work really well to increase your strength and your repetition count. Now, it's not a method typically associated with building muscle, but I think we should think about it like this. In the most basic sense, the process of building muscle is the process of adapting to the demands of your lifestyle. And if you live a lifestyle that requires muscle mass, your body will adapt to meet those demands of your lifestyle. And this is why people who don't do any structured resistance training, but have physically demanding jobs like construction workers, roofers, iron workers, masons, and plenty of other manual laborers, this is why they're so much stronger and carry way more muscle mass than people who are sedentary. And it's not like people with physically demanding jobs or training to failure on a daily basis. It's more like they're greasing the groove constantly. They're performing a high volume of moderate intensity muscular efforts kind of spread throughout the day. And this is sufficient to signal to your body that it needs to grow some muscle to cope with the physical demands of that particular lifestyle. So in other words, your level of adaptation rises to accommodate the stimulus that you're presenting to your body. Now, for anyone who's ever had a cast on their arm, this is another really good example. When you take that cast off, the muscle is shriveled and atrophied, and you can just see how much muscle you built just from living your normal life and performing day-to-day -day tasks. And walking, which is not something we typically think of as a potent muscle builder, is actually a crazy muscle building stimulus for someone who's been bedridden due to injury or illness. In that context, walking will add pounds of muscle to a person. And it does so without approaching muscular failure. So in both of these cases, the signal is strong enough to force a new level of adaptation, but of course, only to a certain point. Now with grease in the groove, it's not likely to turn you into the Hulk or maximize your growth response, but that's because the stimulus doesn't demand that. And while we wanna focus on hard sets to efficiently maximize our response to training, it's not as if greasing the groove won't build any muscle at all. So if greasing the groove is a method that you like to use, or if it just works better with your lifestyle, but maybe you've heard that it won't build any muscle at all, don't dismiss the muscle building potential of frequent moderate efforts performed consistently over time. And while it's not going to maximize the growth response, it will certainly keep you way more muscular than if you didn't train at all. And it might very well surprise you. So if you guys have any questions at all, let me know. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.